These ruins are old. Maybe a thousand years or more. This looks promising. Yes, definitely early Akaviri stonework here. We've got to get this bridge down. These pillars must have something to do with it. Yes, these are Akaviri symbols. Whatever you did, let's see what those old blades left in our way. symbols on the floor? Mm. Esbern's right. Look like pressure plates. We'll cross once it's safe. Be careful. Thousand years or more. Wonderful, remarkably well preserved. Here's the Blood Seal, another of the lost Akaviri arts. No doubt triggered by, well, blood. Your blood, Dragonborn. Look here. You see how the ancient blades revered me in Cyrodiil? There's no telling what we might find inside.
Baldwin's Wall, so well preserved. I've never seen a finer example of early Second Era Kaviri sculpture and relief. Yes, yes, let's see what we have. Look, here is Aldrin. This panel goes back to the beginning of time. When Alduin and the Dragon Cult ruled over Skyrim. Here, the humans rebelled against their Dragon Wall Lord, the legendary Dragon Wall. Alduin's defeat is the centerpiece of the world. You see, here is falling from the sky. The Nord Tom's masters of the voice are arrayed against him. So does it show how they defeated him? Isn't that why we're here? Ah, patience. The Akaviri were not a straightforward people. Everything is couched in allegory, mythic symbolism. Yes, yes. This here, coming from the mouths of the Nord heroes, this is the Akaviri symbol for shout. But there's no way to know what shout is meant. You mean they used a shout to defeat Alduin? You're sure? Hmm? Oh, yes. Presumably something rather specific to dragons. Or even Alduin himself. Remember, this is where they recorded all the new of old wind and old turn. So we're looking for a shout then. Damn it. You ever heard of such a thing? A shout that can knock a dragon out of the sky? You're probably right. I was hoping to avoid having to involve them in this, but it seems we have no choice. Right. Good thing they've already let you into their little cult. Not likely they'd help Esbern or me if we came calling. We'll look around Skyhaven Temple and see what else the old blades might have left for us. It's a better hideout than I could have hoped for. Talos guard you. Look here, in the third panel. The prophecy which brought the Akaviri to Tamriel in the first place, in search of the Dragonborn. Here are the Akaviri, the blades. You see their distinctive long swords. Now they need their ancient mission fulfilled, as the last dragonborn contends with Aldrin at the end of time. Are you paying attention, Delphine? You might learn something of our own history. I know the prophecy by heart. Once all blades knew it, when misrule takes its place at the eight corners of the world, when the brass tower rocks and time is reshaped, when the thrice-blessed fail and the red tower trembles, when the dragonborn ruler loses his throne and the white tower falls, when the snow tower lies sundered, kingless, bleeding, the world eater wakes and the wheel turns upon the last Dragonborn. Well, Did I'm you need something? See what the old blades left for us. Haven't you been paying attention to anything I've said? Only you can finally defeat Aldrin and avert the end of the world. If we can just find out what shout the Nord heroes used, you may have a chance. Or not. There's no guarantee with prophecy. Merely hope. Yes, yes, that's an excellent idea. Who knows what other lost treasures we might discover. 